This is a fierce battle and reinforcements are sorely needed. Military medical staff drafted from Shanghai to go to Wuhan, the epicenter of this epidemic. Ground zero. Ten days ago, there are only 41 cases of novel coronavirus. Now, there are more than 1,200. Officials in Hubei have said they are running low on medical supplies, and hospitals have made their own appeals for donations from the public. The city is on ever greater lockdown, with cars now banned. 56 million people in the region are under a travel ban. So we were shown pictures of the Chinese Politburo in action, including President Xi Jinping. It might not seem much, but it's rare for Chinese state media to broadcast meetings like this. The aim is to show how seriously the leadership is taking the outbreak, even if none of them has yet visited Wuhan. The rest of China is closing off. Shanghai Disneyland, Disney Town including Walt Disney Grand Theater and Wishing Star Park are temporarily closed now. Disneyland Shanghai should be packed over the New Year's break. Instead, it's empty. This was already ambitious, to build a thousand-bed hospital from scratch in less than a week. But authorities have decided it will not be enough. A second, bigger hospital has been commissioned. Each hour seems to bring a new measure from the Chinese government, and that seems to offer the opposite of reassurance. If the response is like this, how big must the danger be? Tom Cheshire, Sky News, Beijing.